Hello, YouTube. I know I've been missing for a couple of days, but we've had no product. And uh, there's really been nothing to do. So I just, you know, took a break waiting for product. But today is the day. As you can see, we have our battle styles. Well, the Japanese version of battle styles. So solid strike and rapid strike. We have our boxes. Um, and I have the promo packs, so that's really cool. We get to see what's in those. And this is kind of like, um, a celebration video because we have more of this stuff to open and we're going to get ready for opening that, but that's going to be live. So we're going to open these today, talk about it, experience the cards, be super happy uh, seeing them, and I'm going to be promoting my stream this Saturday uh, on Twitch, where I'm going to be opening um, another 24 boxes of this product. So we're going to be opening 12 more of this and 12 more of that, and it's going to be a wild time. So with that, we have our trusty scissors, we have our sleeves, and you know what? I actually don't like the lighting in here with just those lights. So I need, I need some more lighting. Just a bit more. All right, cool. Yeah, that's much better. Yeah, I like that. That's much better. Okay, so let's get started. I uh, want to look at the box. So what do we got on the side? Yipper. Okay, so this has the Hound Doom in it right here. Uh, so this one's going to have the Octillery. Um, yeah, because this is Rapid Strike. And those cards. Okay, so... I feel like we're going to go Solid Strike first. I'm pretty sure Red is Solid Strike. So let's have a look at what the promos are. We're going to open the promo first. Now I'm also happy because I didn't know if I was getting the promos with... Ooh! Oh, can't show that. Oh, so this is my ticket. So I wonder how they're going to... Oh, there's a QR code? Huh. I wonder how that's going to work. So the way these tickets work, um, so you get your promo. Like, this thing is so nice looking. Oh, my God. Look at it. That thing is so cool. So we got a Cinderace. Ichigeki. So you get one promo card and one ticket. And the way the ticket works is when the S5A set comes out, you can buy 10, per, 10 booster packs and trade your ticket in for a VMAX of, the, of um, Urshifu, I think. Yeah, I'm not sure. Maybe it's a VMAX of this. Uh, it's, it's not too clear. But So this is the promo that we got. And so whenever you buy one of these, you get this. And then I think it's a Rillaboom is what you get for um, for the Rapid Strike. All right, so put our promo over in the corner. That's actually really cool. I'm going to set this ticket aside because that's important. And let's get the show on the road. I hope everybody has been well. I have been doing great. I've been really busy lately. Uh, I am somewhat in high demand recently, uh, thanks to Pokemon. I have no problems with this, to be quite honest. Uh, it's just, it's a whirlwind sometimes. So, you know, after dealing with that, it's nice because my work days just go by super fast. All right, so this is a mainline set. So the way these work are going to be similar to, like, um, 
Volt Tackle and stuff like that. Where you've got 30 packs and there's five cards per pack. Yep. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. That also means that not every pack is going to have a hollow in it. So I'm expecting we're going to get about f uh, 15 hits from the box. And with that being said, let's let's get to opening. So it also means the card trick is, I think, moving one to the front. So let's do it. I'm excited. We're going to be opening a bunch of these. Uh, so we'll move one to the front, flip it over. Oof. Oh, there's already something in the bot in the pack too. That's awesome. All right. So is this Galarian Slow King or Slowpo Slowbro Slow King? I don't know, but that looks so cool. So how's the? Why is the lighting so bad this time? Is it just me or do I need to move them? All right, so slow bro. I think that's slow bro. Cacnea, Glygor, Gliscor, Gliscor, Electabuzz, baby. Ooh, yo, look at that. We got an Ur Urshifu right out the box. The first pack. Yeah, baby. Gotta get my sleeves out. Look at that bad boy. He's looking good. Back looks really good, too. All right, we already got a hit. Ooh, I wonder what the hollow rares are gonna be in this set. Like, I don't know. We haven't actually seen. Oh, also certain cards are gonna have like the solid strike on it and stuff like that. Uh, all right, so what is this this name? I forget, it's Tepig something and then Mbor, but this is a, a solid strike, so it's an Ichigeki. Ichigeki, uh, Honech, Firo, oh, Tepig's in the same pack, and uh, I don't remember this card's name, is it the the something urn? It's, an, it's one of the urns, right, or the training things, I forget, I'm gonna have to look at the names, we're, we're going kind of blind in this, when it comes to the trainers, um, so what's really cool is the other thing I'm going to do is start building my set this week. So we're gonna, I'm going to organize these cards and put them in a binder. Um, ooh, Aegislash. I love the Aegislashes in this set. I love the way they work. Uh, I don't remember that, per that person's name. Mankey! Uh, Slowpoke. Ooh! What is this? Oh, it's the Apple Dude! It's the Apple Dragon! I, Appleton? Is this Appleton? Yeah, I, that's pretty cool. Okay. Ah, it's an interesting Pokemon to see it up close like that. <laughs> to be quite honest. So we've got two hits so far out of three packs. So that's really nice. Oh, I wonder what our secret rare is going to be. We want an alternate art. Ooh, Primate. Um, a little bug, licky tongue. That art, though, piggy piggy. Ooh, this card. I don't know how I feel about this card, by the way. I really like it because essentially it's a computer search for free, but you end your turn, so it's not free. Uh, but so I could use this, search my deck for any card, put it in my hand. And then my turn is over. So what's really cool about that is if you go first and you can't attack, 
having one of those is very important. Well, not important, because, you know, your, your opponent can always disrupt your hand. Your opponent definitely can disrupt your hand. So there is that. Uh, so until reset stamp gets, gets like, rotated out or something, it kind of defeats the purpose. But then you still have Marnie and stuff, so I don't know. Ooh, Golbat. I like these. This is a draw engine. I don't know if it's going to be good enough with the other cards that are out there, but um, I do like that this this line. Um, Honchcrow is the evolution of this. I forget that one's name. Roly Coley! Spoink. Ooh, our, f ooh, our first hollow rare, and it's uh, Meowstic. I'm, I'm fine with that. I'm fine with Meowstic being, an, being a hollow rare. It is one of my favorite Pokemon. Definitely one of my favorite Pokemon. So one thing that we're going to be doing once we open all of this stuff is uh, I'm going to be building decks and I might be doing some um, some like webcam battling. I'm trying to get my friends to like play. Um, uh, which tower is this? I forget which tower. This is Durant. Ooh, Mawile. Esper. Little thing. I forget. So we're going to be ramping up on on Pokemon content for sure. It's going to be awesome. I'm looking forward to like learning the new meta ahead of the game. And we're going to be opening stuff as well. Uh... Licky Tongue to Licky Licky. Is that that? Yamper. Yamper is an interesting card. Because I think this one's when you play it from your hand, you can search your discard pile for either a Pokeball or a Great Ball and put it back into your hand. I'm not positive on that one. We're going to have to look that up. Uh, Kimeko. Ooh, we got something. Haunch Crow. Ooh, we got Tapu Koko VMAX. Yes. Look at that one. I actually like the Tapu Koko. I don't know if it's going to be that good of a deck. It's It depends. Um, I think people are sleeping on Lightning, though. And I, I really do think Lightning is going to be something really good and playable at some point. So I've got ideas. So, like, I want to play um, a Lightning-type deck. We're making Metal. Metal is, is going to happen. I'm really looking forward to that. For sure. Uh, ooh. Is this Phoebe? This is Phoebe, right? Yep. Yeah. Uh, trainers go there. Uh, Spiro. Dual Blade. Oh, it's Puppy. I forget its name. Boltund. Um, Houndoon? Or Houndour? This is Houndoon. Right? I forget their names. I'm getting them backwards. I'm so sorry, Poke fans. I'm so sorry. But yeah, while you're watching, um, if you want to keep updated with the, the videos that we'll be posting, there's going to be tons of highlights from this weekend stream that are going to go up. Ooh, the fighting energy. Yeah, yes. I love the special fighting energy. So this is fighting in dark. I think as long as this is attached to an Ichigeki card... It's going to provide fighting and dark energy, but you only get one. So you have to choose. Um, Gliss Gore. Salandit. Oh, they had to use that for a Zubat? Come on, guys. Ooh, this card. People have been looking at this card and complaining about it. I don't, you know. So this card, its first attack does three, uh, it costs three colorless, right? It costs three colorless. Why does the light look so bad? Is it just... No, the light looks fine. Okay. So it does 40 damage. And if you knock out a Pokemon with this attack, you take an extra prize. So people are thinking, like, this, this card's going to get out of hand. But it's really not. Maybe it might be annoying if... People put it in ADP because it's going to be in ADP for a while until ADP rotates out. Because I think this set's going to rotate into standard before ro before the other actual rotation. Um, so this will so there will be ADP decks that run that. And so if you alter, is it alter Genesis or alter Creation? I forget the name. If you alter, 
you're doing 30 more damage and you're getting an extra prize. So this guy gets gets you two extra prizes because of his attack. Uh, Ichigeku, uh, Stone Jorner, Tepig. This is why I want... Me oh, I can't wait to build metal. The Bronzong is so good in this set. I think people are like sleeping on that card. I like the buzz. Escape Rope. This makes me so happy that Escape Rope's getting uh, reprinted. I'm so, so happy that I saw that. Yeah, we're getting two, at least two reprints in this set. We're getting the Escape Rope reprint, and we're getting Level Ball reprinted. So that's that's really cool. Uh, Drampa. Cacturn. No. Yeah, Cacturn. Gliscor. Slowpoke. See this? Ooh, it's a hollow too. Wow. So yeah, this card. Um, its ability says as many times as you want during your turn, you can you you can move one of your metal po metal energy um, to one of your other Pokemon. It's well, damn! I lost a card. I'll have to get that later. I'm sorry, I'm going to have a million of them. So it, it's kind of like mad, but like it's really cool because it lets you um, move energy from other Pokemon that put it on themselves or stuff like that. I'd have to get the exact English translation, but I like this card and I think it's going to be very important for Metal Decks. Uh, Electivire, this bug, Mankey, Hone Edge. Ooh, the Ichigeki Fighting Scroll. Sweet. So what that does is when you, when you... It's a tool, and when you put it on your Pokemon, it gives them this attack, but it has to be an Ichigeki. It has to be an Ichigeki. All right. My boy... Um... Coal cart, Roly Coley, Grumpig, more Peko, but hungry more Peko. Ooh, yes. This card looks so good. Oh, man. Look at that. Uh, always a fan favorite, this Pokemon, I believe. This one's really cool. I think this one lets you search for something. Uh, it's either energy or... A card. I forget. Octillery does a different thing. I I'm gonna have to like look at the uh, the translations for sure. Oh, the uh, the fighting the Ichigeki fighting style, dude. Esper, Firo, Cacturn, Piggy Pig. Cool. All right. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wow. We're about seven. We're about seven hits away, roughly. Seven or eight. All right. Ooh. Oh God. What's this guy's name? Is this? Br I want to say Bruce. This bro's name is Bruce, dude. I don't think his name is Bruce. Um. Mawile, Licky Tongue, the Crow Dude, and Primate. All right, so that's that half of the box. We got one more half to go. Let's keep the hits coming. Let's get a Secret Rare. We haven't gotten a Full Art or a Secret Rare yet. Um, hopefully, we'll get another VMAX. I think it's typically two VMAXs and at least one Ultra Rare in the set. So you either get a... Um, you either get um, like a full art or a gold card or something like that. But it's only one spot. Drampa, Dual Blade, Licky Tongue, Buggy Bug, and... Oh, yes! Yes, we got the Marshadow. This card's going to be super important. This card, this ability basically makes it immune. But I think you have to play it from your hand that turn. So you like play it. And then switch it in and make it active. 
and it takes like no damage from Pokemon V's and V Maxes. I have to read it um, again to be more clear, but that's actually going to be very important when it comes to uh, gameplay. Oh, another Bruce. We're going to call him Bruce until I remember his actual name. Uh, Durant, Roly Coley, Esper, Electrovire. All right, don't be a dud. Be a good box. Please, please have sent me two good boxes. So if you're wondering why I have 13 of each box, it's because initially the place that I ordered from didn't say that I was going to get the promos with the boxes. Ooh, EXP shares getting reprinted too. That's also a really good one. Uh, Gligor, Haunch, Baby Crow, Mawile. Oh, snap! We got this as our full art. Yo, that looks so good. Look at that. That looks really nice. Oh my god. All right, I'm going to have to get an extra one of these for my friend. He loves lightning decks. Sweet. So that's our full art hit. So that's what we got for the for the set, for the box. That's fine. I like that one. All right. Um I don't know that one's name. Salandit, Houndoom, Chimeco, Fighting Dude. I think that's how I, I need to remember. It's I think it's Houndour and then Houndoom, right? Or is it Houndoom and Houndour or Houndour? I'm bad. I'm bad. I don't remember. I don't remember. Stone Joiner. Yamper, Zubat, Cacturn. Ooh. I didn't know. Oh, I did know there was an Entei in the set. That's actually really cool. Why no Amazing Rares, though? Huh? Where are my Amazing Rares? Please and thank you. So, yeah. Uh, this Saturday, we're going to be opening 12 boxes of each set. Uh, so we have the scroll. We have bronze plate dude. We have more Peko. We have Firo. Ooh, that guy's a hollow rare. Okay. Okay. Embor. We got Embor. So um, it's twitch.tv forward slash trin tv i'll put the links in the description below too i'd love to see you there so we can hang out and open some more of this pokemon it's going to be a big one it's uh, like i want to open all of it it's going to be great uh so yeah I, I hope you stop by also remember give this video a like if not for me for more peko do it for more peko more peko needs more likes uh, Galarian Slow Bro, I think, or Slow King. Is this Slow King? No, this is Slow Bro. Uh, Roly Coley, Cacturn, Licky Tongue, and the Scroll. Okay. Remember, we got one more box to open after this, and it's going to be the other set. So that's going to be great. All right, we got Aegislash. So, so this this set has two different age. Actually, there's two different Aegislash. I don't know if they're both in the same set, but this ability says you can take this and put it back in your hand and switch it with another Aegislash. So there's two different Aegislashes, which is really cool. Um, Mawile, Crow Dude, Kimeko. Ooh, another one of these. I'm actually fine with that. So I wonder, are we only going to get one VMAX in the box? 
I mean, I know the printing press, like the printings are always different. So we don't really know. I haven't opened enough of this. Uh, the fighting stone urn thing. Um, Durant, more Peko, Esper, and Primate. Also, hopefully, I'm getting two more boxes of Shiny Star V this weekend. So we might even, like, do that in between. Golbat, Fero, Salandit, Yamper. Ooh, another one of those. Yes. So I want to make, I want to physically make decks. So I'm going to be uh, using these as proxies because, you know, why not? If I have them, I'm going to have tons of copies of these cards. So the idea is we're going to be doing some play testing, some deck building. I'm going to try to get my friends to do some uh, webcam matches with me. And we're just going to like, we're going to do a lot of stuff. We're going to keep up with the current meta because like my one friend has to test current stuff. So we'll do that on PC, PTCGO. We got Phoebe. We got Spiro. We got an Electi uh, Electabuzz, Dogadoos, and Sol Solanda, whatever. <laughs> um, but then I also want to try to do some like physical play testing um, and building decks because I want to I want to see what the meta is going to be like with these cards in it. And then what's really cool is one thing I want to do is I want to try post rotation once the other set comes out in April. Ooh, another escape rope. Zubat. Blip bug. Oh, Colossus is a rare, is a hollow rare in here. So the other thing that's going to be interesting is which ones of these cards are they going to make regular rares for our sets? Because that's what they do. They're going to change some of these from hollows to regular rares, and they're going to change some of the regular rares to hollow rares, and it's going to be annoying. But hey, Licky Lick, Gliscor, Tepig, Slowpoke, Boltund. All right, we got two more packs left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So we have one more pull, probably but most likely not. Yeah, we got our pool. <laughs> it was like, most likely, no, we got the tower. Uh, Mankey, Cacturn, Spoink, and, oh, there's our VMAX. We got the Urshifu VMAX. Sweet. One thing that I've also noticed about Japanese boxes is it's a good chance that if you get a VMAX in the box, you get its non-VMAX form. But that's not always the case. Sometimes you'll get an extra of one. Like, this one's weird because we got the full art of that with that. So we still got the pair. Um, either way... Oh, we have one more pack. I was about to clean up and go to the next box. Maybe this is a good box and there's an extra, there's an extra pull. Nah. Uh, Roly Coley, the, no, Colcart, Grumpig, Honchcrow, and Honedge, and the Energy. We got an Energy. All right, cool. So that is our Ichigeki box. Our Solid Strike, as they're calling it here. This was not a bad box. So we got... We got the Tapu Koko Full Art. We got the Tapu Koko V Max. We got the Urshifu V Max, but the Ichi Ichigeki one. We got that. We got two Stantlers or st or st Stout Doggy Dudes. Uh, we got the Mimikyu and we got the Apple Dude. So that's actually pretty cool. That's a, that's a good run. Honestly, we'll keep those up there for now, and we're gonna move on to our other box. Um, I'm, I'm so looking forward to opening the rest of these. Cool. Okay. So it is a Rillaboom. 
I need to put these somewhere else. I don't want to lose them. So yeah, Rengeki. So it's Ichigeki and Rengeki. So now we're on our Rengeki, and this is the promo for that. It's actually really cool. Okay, we'll put him there. We'll put this stack here. Put that. We'll put that stack like this. Oh, I know what we'll do. We'll go like that. There. This is this is the stack for this box. Now we'll get real boom out there, and we will open our other box. So there's about 70 cards in the set before you get your secret rares and stuff, or your ultra rares or hyper rares or hidden rares or whatever. Um, so I foresee filling the main sets very fast. I don't know how many of the actual um, extra like rares we're going to get. I'm probably going to have to get my hands on some um, after opening it. Because, you know, you never guarantee what you're going to get. You know, there's always duplicates. All right, let's start. So means Octillery is going to be a hollow rare, which is cool. All right, we're going to get something right out the gate. Uh, Jellybeard Fish? I don't remember that one. I don't remember that name either. <coughs> Indeedy? Oh. Victory Bell. Level Ball. The level ball looks really cool. I, I think bringing back level ball is going to be really game changing. It's weird because like, I don't know if it's going to be as well, we might be losing quick ball. Actually, we'll probably be losing quick ball. That's why we're getting it. Um, the weird bug timber by sharp. Fomantis. All right. I wonder if each box is just going to have an Ichi, is uh, an Urshifu. So we got ourselves our Rengeki Urshifu. Fitting. First card. Oh. I, um. Yeah, I forgot. I need to keep these separate. This is not the the English set. <laughs> They'll both be together in one set called Battle Styles uh, when this is translated to English. So it's going to be a, hu a bigger set. Uh, but I need to keep these separate because these are considered two different sets. So when I'm, you know, making my set binder, which I'm going to be doing. Uh, Rengeki Tower. I forget what tower that is. Uh, I don't know what card that is. That's weird. Um, Buffalot, Galarian Mr. Mime, Sent a Scorch. So, what do we want from here? We want, I would like, I'd like a gold card. Can we get one of the gold cards? Ooh, is this Mian Fu? Mian Fu, uh, little buddy. Cubone. That's, I don't remember that fish. Ooh. So Steelix is the hollow, is a hollow rare. Okay. Watch that Steelix be a regular rare in the English set. I'm going to make that Steelix a regular rare in English. Oh, it's so funny. I, I bet. Uh, that bro, Cheruby, Mianfu. I don't know what this one is. Ooh, Orbeetle. Orbeetle? Orbeetle's kind of cool. I don't know what it does. 
I haven't read every single card yet. I have to sit down and read every single card. So that's something we'll probably be doing. Uh, all right, Rengeki Tower. Ooh, Lux. Luxury is the final form. Shinx, Shinx. Little Mantis dude. Seedra. Ooh. Is that Luxray? No, it goes Shinx something, then Luxray, right? Also, I love shiny version of that Pokemon. Looks really awesome. Ooh. We got the Rengeki energy. That's really cool. We got the Victory Bell. No, Weeping Bell. It's a Weeping Bell. Uh, by Sharp. Uh, the Fish. Ooh! Oh, wow! Okay. Well, we got our full art. This card's actually going to be really playable, too. That's kind of sick. That's kind of a really sick full art, actually. Look at the color on that. All right, well, don't need to open the rest of the box. No, I'm just kidding. I bet people are cringing every time I cut the packs. Like, no, don't cut the card. Ooh, uh, Phalanx, the plant dude, Timber, uh, Jellyfish, Karina. Oh, I was hoping for a full art Karina. So we need full art trainers. If we could open... Over the weekend, full art, like all the full art trainers, then I'll be happy because I don't want to have to buy those online. <laughs> I don't want to have to buy those online for sure. Uh, Cedra, Glam Meow, Mianfu, Mr. Mime. Ooh, yes! This card is something I'm super excited about too. The, um, the Victini VMAX. I can't wait. So, I think that the other Victini V is better than the one in this set, by the way. I I think I want to play that one instead. Um, I'm not sure. We're going to have to figure it out, because it might just be useless. Because it doubles up on the same move that this Victini has. But, I don't know. Pake? Pake? Pake machine? I don't even know what this is, actually. I don't know what that is. Cubone! Electric Mouse 2! Crawdon! Victory Bell! Victory Bell! Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, I hope everybody hangs out this weekend with me. Ooh, full art of her, too. I forget her name, but we need that one. Onyx, Cherubi, Buffalant, Empoleon. Yes. Got an Empoleon. That car looks nice. I think the Empoleon's going to be cool, too. I don't know. I'm just excited by this set. I think it's like, I'm really happy. Like someone's going to find some card that's going to be the collector's card. And you know, they're going to like, it's going to be expensive and everybody's going to want to get it. But then when people start like figuring it out, this set doesn't have anything like th it, of that stature. I don't think, um, this is clay doll, um, timber, Conclador, I think. Blitblug. Remoraid? No, yeah, it's Remoraid. And Marowak. Uh, I don't think this set's going to be too crazy. Like like Vivid Voltage is. I think people are going to realize that there's not that many Super Collector's cards in it. And there's not going to be that one card. I mean, I could be wrong. But I think this is a player's set. This is going to be like tons of stuff for people to play with. Um, so this, this is a really good set. Sent to Scorch. Claydol. Bisharp. Octillery. Yes. So, like, that's why I'm interested in this set, is because I think there's playable cards in it. Lots of playable cards in it. I mean, 
the Ichigeki and Rengeki themselves change the way the game works because you're building around that kind of fighting style. I also think that, that we're only going to get two sets for this. Um, Lorantis, Silly Cobra, Bellsprout, Perugly? Or is that Glam Meow? And then there's the fan. Um, I don't think that they're going to continue Ichi and Rengeki for um, the rest of the year. I think that we're going to get... This is just for DLC-based content. So this set, we're getting Isle of... I think this is Isle of Armor stuff. And then the April set that they're getting is going to be Crown Tundra stuff, and it has Ichige Ichi Ichigenki, Ichi Rengeki, and Ichigeki. It has those that mechanic as well. Um, I don't know this one's name. Horsey. Shinx. The Lava Dude. Topo Bulu. Because I think the last, I think the last set of the year is going to be um, tied into the the 25th anniversary. Now, they could change it. Don't, don't quote me. This is not like... Well, you can quote me, but this is not like confirmed or anything. But I think that uh, the last set of the year is going to be um, whatever... They're going to do something similar to Evolutions. I don't want it to be Evolu... I don't want an Evolutions 2, but I think they're going to do something similar to it. Um, and again, I could be wrong. This is just speculation. Based on what they did um, prior. Galarian Mr. Rhyme. I think that's Conkledor. Or no, this is a... Uh, uh, Red Hot Cinnamon Gummy Worm. Silly fish. Santa Cobra. But yeah, that's that's my speculation. My other speculation is the English release of the April set. So the April set is called um there's two of them. It's it's uh I think it's something Silver Lance and uh Black Geist. And it's based off of uh, the, the, the character that they have on the front is the Crown Tundra, I think, legendary. The similar to, like, Urshifu's this one. We got the Energy, we got the Blip Bug, we got the Glam Meow. Or is this Pur Ugly? Glam Meow. Uh, clay Doll and other Clay Doll. Bigger Clay Doll. I don't know. I don't remember their, their, all their names. So what I worry is when that set is made into English, that set's going to be huge because Japan is getting um, match, uh, peerless fighters in March, which is going to be uh, an S5A set. So it's going to be the set between this and the next one. And so I don't know what kind of set that's going to be. There's two options we get. That set is... That set's printed in um, either whatever the, the Pokemon packs... That set's going to go in one of two sets. I think it's going to go in with the 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 Lance and Geist sets. So that set's going to be huge. Uh, Energy Recycler, that's another reprint I'm actually very happy about. Onyx, uh, Perugly, Remoraid. Ooh, Corvic Knight VMAX. Oh, this thing is awesome looking. I like this card too. This is one of the other reasons I think Metal's going to be like... I want to make a Metal deck so bad. Like, really badly. Wait, is this real? Does this thing have zero? This thing has no retreat cost. Do you see that? Zero. Oh, God, that's awesome. That's actually really good. I never noticed that. Okay. We're making metal. It sucks because I wanted to make fighting because I really wanted to do a fighting, a fighting, like deck, but we're making, we're making a metal deck. Uh, Phalanx, Cobra Dude, Fomantis, Heatmore, I think? I don't remember. 
some of these Pokemon, I actually don't know their names because they're from gens that I barely played. And, you know, they haven't been really, like, present in decks recently. The Rengeki Scroll, Bellsprout, Bisharp, Seedra. We got the regular Krikatoon. Krikatoon, um, I think once per turn lets you draw cards. And then if he's your active, he lets you draw one extra card when you use his ability. So he's going to be really nice because we do one of index as a draw engine. But he's also a target because he's 180 health. So I don't, I don't really foresee like what's going to happen with that. Um, got that one. We got the plant. Got that. And we got Shinx. Oh, we got... Is that... That's me. Oh, I don't remember that first character. I don't remember. Oh, also, I ordered some of the Honey promo. Uh, I only ordered two because it's expensive. It's like 36 bucks. I want to know how you get it from Japan. Like, officially. and like, Not just buying it off of someone. Uh, Lurantis, Weeping Bell... Mr. Rhyme, Mr. Mime, Sharp. Ooh, the Lux Ray. Look how awesome that looks. I hope they keep that a hollow rare. So, what do you think the pro the pre release promos are going to be in English? Do you think it's going to be an Octillery, a Houndor, um, a Bronzong, and I don't know one other card, Lux Ray maybe? That'd be cool. Ooh, I want a full art Karina. This is Karina's something, though. Cubone, Ndidi, Electric Mouse 2. I don't know what those are. I don't know what this one is. Jellicent? Is it Jellicent? Are you Jellicent? <laughs> I'm just talking here. I apologize. I gotta get a couple more hits. I wish I knew what this was called. This is a new one, though. I don't recognize the, the thing. Me and Fu, Bouffalant, that. Kingdra? Oh, no, is this, uh. Is this Kingdra? I have to see what that one does. I don't know what it does. I haven't been reading all of them, like I said. I have not read what all of them do. But yeah, one thing that we might do on Saturday is if I get my boxes, uh, Marowak, Conkledore, Crawfish, Claydol, that dude. Uh, if I get my two boxes of, what do you call it? Shiny Star V, what we'll probably do is we'll open all 12 boxes of one of them and then take a break to open the Shiny Star V and then open the rest of the boxes of the other set. Uh, Victory Bell. I don't know which one Glam Meow and which one Pur Ugly is. Uh, we got that. Cheruby. Ooh. Yes. We got the Corvus, Corvus Knight V to go with our VMAX. I'm so happy this thing's metal. Oh, God. We're making a metal deck. We're making metal. Need to get more of the Corvus Knight VMAX. I'm going to want to get, like, two cases of this in English. I'm trying. I'm trying to get two cases minimum. Minimum. Uh, Big Boy. Perugly. Blip Bug. Cinnamon Gummy Worm. And I don't know that one. Because I haven't memorized them all. And I'm opening these before they're in English first. So, uh, yes. So, yes. All right. We got the fan. Got Sandy Cobra. Heat more. 
silly fish. <gasps> we got a hyper. Oh, snap. Yo, this box was lit. We got a hyper and a full art. Look at that, dude. We got the Rengeki hyper of this guy. That's sweet. That's a beautiful card. Well, that's one we don't have to buy. Nice. Nice. I hope we... I hope out of a case, I complete the whole set. And we get enough extras. That's cool. That was a hit. Send a Scorch. Shinx. Seedra. Fomantis. The Tower. That's cool. That's actually really cool knowing you can get... So the Hypers, I think, don't take your, your spot. I think you... you you get one of these. You get a full art. Um, and then you have a chance that you could get a hyper as well. Me and Fu, Weeping Bell, Jelly Jelly Jelly, Conkle Door, another level ball. All right. Well, that was a good box. That was actually a good box, too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Got seven of those, and we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We got eight hits here, and what's really nice is we got a full art and a hyper. Oh, those are so cool. And then we got dog hair. We got Corvic Knight and VMAX. We got a Victini VMAX. We got the Urshifu, we got Krikatoon, and we got Empoleon. All right. I'm happy with these two boxes. And we got that. All right. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Well, I want to thank everybody for hanging out and watching today. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you on Saturday. So on Saturday, I plan on booting up the stream around 9.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And then uh, probably get situated, take about 15, 20 minutes to like let people get in and hang out and stuff like that. Maybe like a half hour. We'll see. And then we're going to start opening because it's going to be opening all like I'm going to go until we stop. Like there's no more. That's the plan. Um, so, like I said, it'll be twitch.tv forward slash trend TV. That's T-R-Y-N-N-E-T-V. Descriptions will be in the box below. And if you can't make it for the stream, don't worry. I am going to have tons of highlights from the stream to post on the highlight portion of the channel. So I really do appreciate you all hanging out if you've stuck it out this far. I look forward to seeing you. And uh, yeah, if you like the video, Please give it a thumbs up. It helps. Share it with your friends. Um, and uh, if not for me, do it for uh, more Peko. Yeah, do it for more Peko. Because we all love more Peko, right? Anyways, thanks for watching, everybody. We will see you next time. Everything that's important will be in the description box below. Links and all of that. Thank you, thank you. Oh, and uh, make sure to check me out on Instagram because I post a lot of pictures about Pokemon. You can find me, Pokemon uh, Poke Collector Trin on Instagram. That'll be linked below as well. All right, look forward to seeing y'all. Bye. Have a great one, and we'll see you in the next video.